During the month of May, we are celebrating and honoring Asian Americans and Pacific Islanders. Yeah, breaking barriers. And today, we're going to introduce you to Candy Tong. Boy, you can see she's a professional dancer, a model, fashion entrepreneur. She's living her dream in New York City. She is an advocate for Asian Americans in the arts, and Crown Force Gail Ong has more. At nine years old, Candy Tong knew she found her calling. Being an Asian American dancer is already so rare in my world. Um, I remember growing up at Sarasota Ballet, I only got to look up to two Asian American dancers. Tong says she was one of three to four Asian American students in her class at the San Francisco Ballet, but never saw herself as being a minority, but felt different after landing the role of Clara in The Nutcracker. It's not known to have an Asian Clara, black Clara. So for me to have had that role at such a young age was, I knew it was something very special and something I had to bring along with me in the future. That future leading Tong to train at Pacific Northwest Ballet in Seattle, Washington, an English national ballet in the United Kingdom. But she faced challenges while auditioning for professional dance companies all around Europe. One. I was too tall. I'm 5'10", without point shoes or heels. Uh, secondly, my American visa. And thirdly, that I was Asian. And so hearing those three things, especially about my race, was difficult and also just incredibly frustrating. Tung says those three repeaters often came up in post-audition feedback. The San Mateo County native advocates for diversity in the renowned dance world, an industry she says Asians are underrepresented. And it's 2021 and I want people to push their limits and be who they are, be unapologetically you, be unapologetically Asian and just go about life how you were born to be. Unapologetically Asian is a movement Tong started in 2019 before the pandemic and heightened reports of attacks on the Asian community. Tong credits the support of her parents who encouraged her to pursue her passion in dance. Fashion designer is the latest title to her name. Her dancewear line launched right before parts of the country issued stay-at-home orders. Tong is living in New York City under contract with Complexion's Contemporary Ballet, a place that allows her to travel Travel the world showing passion for the arts and music. I want to be a mentor for young Asian American dancers. I want to be their inspiration. I want to make a change, whether it's in the dance world, modeling world, or my new world as a dancepreneur, fashion designer. <laughs> a a dancepreneur, I like oh, that. That's awesome. <laughs> well done. Uh, again, that was Gail Long reporting for us this morning on the story of Candy Tong. Incredible. Be sure to join Crown 4's Will Tran and Gail for a 30-minute special entitled Stopping Anti-Asian Hate. We're going to air that Sunday night, May 30th at 6.30 p.m. So make sure you tune in for that. 651 right now.